Okay, today's project. There's so much theft going on these days. I don't trust anybody anymore. So I want to make the greatest, most heavy duty trailer lock in the history of trailer locks. This is what we're putting together. So I'm going to weld these two pieces of angle iron on here. Two purposes. They're going to align this. But also, I had these cut up at the local welding shop. And they cut them too short. So I had to shim them anyway. So those two pieces are going to be the exact thickness I need. And uh, after I've got these welded on, I'll adjust these nuts, uh, bolts here, to get these so they just are snug against that angle. And then I'll weld that on there too. This bolt is going to be cut right here, and I'll be putting a hole in this for a lock on the end of this bolt. That's the setup here, that's what's going to happen. Well, I got a couple of welds done here. I got the inside of this done, and those are my first welds. They're real, really crappy. Slight improvement on this nut. And then uh, here's the bead I just laid on this one. So, yeah, my beads get a little better as they go, but they're never going to be pretty. But they won't come apart. Now we got to get the other piece. This is where the angle iron is really going to help me. It's going to make it way easier to align. Now I just got to drill the bolt 
they already flattened it here and I put a whole bunch. I was going to drill it there, but I, I've got room with this lock to come in further, so I'm going to come in right here. You guys are always trying to cut. bolt drilled. I had to go get a lock with a longer shank, but that's okay, that works. I got one little thing left here I want to do. I'm going to knock these corners off here. Start corners. Put this thing on this boat trailer here and see what happens. This, of course, is like the most overkill <laughs> lock you'd ever have, but. said earlier we're building two of them we'll put one on this uh, utility trailer as well it will be the very same procedure so I will not bother I will show the end result once I have it built I will uh, you know, I'll show it I'm going to uh, assemble this so to make sure it's aligned correctly. Part, then we'll weld. So I got the second lock built. This is on my uh, 16 foot utility trailer. And the lock that I made for my boat trailer. Huh. Uh, that'll keep the honest thieves away anyway. Or the lazy thieves, I guess. Anyway, that's. Uh, my do-it-yourself uh, so that's it I got one thing left to do here to finish my locks I weld that on here like so go over here and I'll show you this guy's gonna get welded on here right there Uh, 
actually just looking at this I'm gonna have to add a piece here at the back as well right here the whole purpose of this is so someone can't put bolt in I need to put the piece here but I also am gonna have to put that here and then this will be welded weld it on here damn it There's one piece. Okay, I'll go right here. Lovely. Okay. We'll cut another one. Okay, now I'm gonna weld this cover on. Piece number two. extra weight that's sitting on there the lock doesn't want to sit up right there that doesn't matter it ain't coming off this guy same thing well don't look at the lawn I don't even want to talk about that project that there's evil evil okay 